Hello my dear friends of electronics. Today I invite my colleague Florian. Hi Florian. Hi, because man. I have a USB type C application and I was not able to transfer 100 watt because I was assuming the connector is more important but the connector was not running hot but the wall PCB was too hot and I was not reached at 100 watt transfer. Mm -hmm. So for my redesign, I need from you some advice because you're the USB Type-C specialist. Mm. What I need to take in consideration for the next design? Okay, so first of all, thank you very much for your invitation. Uh, when it comes up about uh, the USB-C type, uh, there's one thing to mention. Uh, that is uh, the power delivery mode, uh, which goes up to 100 watt, and that's exactly what you try to um, to supply or to transfer. And um, uh, for USB, there are a couple of modes, different modes, starting with 10 watt and going up to 100 100 watt for the power delivery mode. And um, due to this, this it's important to have got um, to choose the required components, such as the connectors, for sure, but also the passive components, what you also did, and um, but also the cable is an important aspect in this case. Uh, I brought you some, some samples, two of them. Uh, first, also some, some pictures of an X-ray, where you can see the difference. Uh, the okay. cable uh, on the right-hand side is with a, an e-marker inside. You can see a little microcontroller, mm -hmm. which communicates uh, the different uh, power delivery modes. And uh, next to that, it's just a simple connector, that one over here, without internals, just um, conductors and capacitors inside. Oh, so this is a big difference. So not only just uh, passive components. I, I did filter for EMI the TVS on the front for ESD suppression. Yep. I put the, the common mode show for the data the lines and also the filtering for the power uh, line. Um, of course, this is also important which kind of cable they use. Yep. Okay, so this is this is something very important which I did not know before. Yep. I was assuming cable, USB cable is USB cable. Yep. But it uh, seems that um, these four pins, which is delivering four times mm -hmm. 1.25 amp, mm -hmm. uh, connector is good, copper cable is good, but you need a controller as well. Definitely, yeah. absolutely right. Oh. So what you also mentioned in correct way are these four pins, shown here in red, where the voltage uh, is applied, current is transferred. Um, yeah, that's a very important aspect. But also, what I've uh, shown you over here are two uh, tiny little PCBs uh, for also customers' wishes if they are interested in it. One is for the 60 watt, and the other one is for 100 watt. All right, nice. Thank you. So, hope you get some new information about USB Type C, and uh, please watch my next videos.